Line 22, 7B, 97Z, 57F, data, molo, density, transformations, geographic coordinates, 5G, well study. There's the alien radio signal. This is keyword research, datum coordinates, Helmert 7, Bursa Wolf transformation, the Molodensky Badiska, 10 parameter transformation equations, rotation vectors for UFO mapping, outer space transport vehicle found in line 22 well data. September 19, 2013, we were looking at the videos. Uh, I'm not going to read all of them I did in the last video. So it was line 22, 7B, 97Z, 57A. That's where we started at Coastal Navigation Reference Points Outer Space UFO Ballistics Formula 5G Well Study. And now we are up to F, okay? So I googled the keywords for bore alignment laser, um, then datum shift came up, transformations and coordinate transformations. We're still working on that. Uh, the reference is coordinate transformations August 2009, presented by R. Nippers. And the website's Cartoweb, K A R T O W E B dot I T C dot N L is where the data is from. Um, datum transformations via geocentric coordinates. And it continues from the previous video, quotes some diagrams from the blog. So datum transformations via the geographic coordinates directly relate the ellipsoidal latitude F and longitude L and possibly also the ellipsoidal height H of both datum systems. This is illustrated in the figure below. Okay, that shows the equator and this is the Greenwich Meridian right there. Make that a little bit bigger. Okay. The principles of changing from one datum into another datum via the 3D geographic coordinates. The applied methods for a datum transformation via the three-dimensional geographic coordinates are 1. The geographic offsets, 2. The Mol Molodensky and abridged Molodensky transformation, and 3. The multiple regression transformation. Uh, 1. The simplest method uses geographic offsets. It relates both datum systems with only two parameters, the difference in the geographic latitude DF and the difference in the geographic longitude DL. The ellipsoidal height H is mostly not included. The method is only used for purposes where low accuracy can be tolerated. The equation is datum B equals F, datum A plus DF, datum B equals L, datum A plus DL. Number two, a second method of directly transforming latitude, longitude, and height is the standard Molodensky and abridged Molodensky transformation. It should not be confused with the Molodensky and Baditas transformation. The standard equations directly relate ellipsoidal latitude and longitude coordinates and ellipsoidal height of two datums by deriving the geographic coordinates offsets. The abridged form is found by dropping any terms that are second order in small parameters and the ellipsoidal height h is ignored. Refer to the OGP Guidance Note 7, page 112, for the abridged versions of the formulas and a detailed explanation. The simplified e equation is, and you can see all the letters there, F equals F, and then there's DX, DY, DZ, DA, and DF, okay? Where DX, DY, DZ are the geocentric translation parameters, center offset between the two datums, DA is the difference in the semi-major axis of the target and the source ellipsoids, DF is the difference in the flattening of the two ellipsoids. The Molodensky equations are commonly used to relate ellipsoidal latitude and longitude coordinates and ellipsoidal height of a local geodatic datum to, who's the, to those of the WGS 84 datum. An example is ex illustrated in the figure below, okay? Which you can't really read. It's got a bunch of numbers here. I can't. I have glasses on. I still can't figure out what's what, okay? The principle of changing from a local datum, Bahamas, into the WGS 84 datum via the 3D geographic coordinates using Molodensky, given are the center offset parameters DX, DY, DZ. The difference in the semi-major axis DA and the difference in the flattening DF. The Molodensky equations are easy to use to transform GPS coordinates in WGS84 to a local map coordinate system, map projection, with its own ellipsoidal and datum. Simply the ellipsoid parameters and the datum shift values, center offset between the two datums, are required to relate the two datums. Uh, shows a list of datums and datum shift values, which I didn't bother to bring in. And then there's the website again. And the keyword Molodensky equations will continue in our next video. Thank you for watching.